Let's do energy saving lamp modeling in SOLIDWORKS. Here we will learn some basic features like 3D sketch, dome and extruded boss base. In even we will see how to use swift cut feature. Dimensions in millimeter. The screw diameter of lamp is 26. Screw diameter this uh, talking about this upper side. Pitch is 6 mm, the number of turns 4 mm and the thread profile is 1.5, diameter is 3 mm. The lamp tube has a spiral diameter of 40 mm, these are talking about this bottom one. 40 mm pitch of 12 mm and 3 turns with tube diameter of 7 mm, okay. This diameter is 7 mm and total 3 turns, okay, let's see. So we will start with upper length 25, this length how much uh, you will see here uh, 20. Now this is dome shape, the radius uh, distance 3 millimeter and diameter how much 26 and 35. Okay. Then at top there is one more 6 dia dome shape, this shape is 0.8, dome size is 0.8 and distance 24 millimeter from here. Right front plane is sketch activate line tool. Now select this line construction line is smart dimension twenty five twenty. Now this the diameter is 26 38 now apply here revolve boss base i want to add material in circular direction so you have to choose revolve boss base see Due to this construction line profile is open not close so you want to close say yes. By default system took this line as a center of axis. Uh, angle by default 360 degree a complete circle say ok. See. Let me uncheck. Now let me apply here dome shape. Go to insert feature dome. Now select this face and this distance given 3 millimeter. Say OK. See? A sketch 6 dia circle. And extrude this. Length is given 24 millimeter. See, direction is perfect. Keep end condition blind. And 24 millimeter from this face to here. Okay, again go to insert feature apply dome and this shape how much select this face 0.8. This is the height from this edge. See. Now let's apply a thread here select this face a sketch and select this internal circle convert entity. Go to feature, apply helix and spiral. Okay, this is what we need to apply. Pitch and revolution constant. Now how much pitch is given? 6. Now revolution 4. Counterclockwise. Angle start angle keep 0. Okay. See. Now simply go, go to shift cut. Here choose circular profile. How much profile? Radius 1.5. So diameter is 3. Select this. Now align with end faces. Say OK. Now simply click and hide. See. Now come down. Now let's move this tube now this tube diameter is 7 you will see the bottom view 
the distance between these two 8 8 15 millimeter the distance okay let me see here see this is the tube now see there is a line 15 8 the corner fillet 5 millimeter distance from this face to here 10 millimeter okay similarly like this 10 millimeter the pitch is 12 millimeter now distance from here to here 36 millimeter or not 36 10 then 36 millimeter so and the diameter of this 40 millimeter pitch everything is given pitch 12 3 turns diameter 7 now first now look this is going to start from here to here 35 millimeter okay so we have to create a plane then we, we will create plane select this face apply here 35 millimeter flip offset okay now select the plane one sketch apply circle and here the diameter is 40 millimeter look isometric view okay go to is activate spiral and helix okay make it pitch and revolution make it reverse now constant pitch pitch how much 12 and revolution 3 but let's check what possible clockwise let me check the right plane apply angle 90 degree okay now let me hide this choose right plane sketch let me activate line tool now let's define this this is going to be 10 36 now this is 8 plus 8 16 okay select this origin point and this line make constrained mid plane even though convert this make this line construction line we don't need this line okay but here is a catch simply exit and previous helix and spiral edit 180 degree say ok now this is how we can apply 3d sketch Select this line and these two lines and this one convert entity. Okay. Activate line tool. Start from here. Move x direction. Okay. Then press tab key and connect with this. Press escape key to out. Similarly do this, activate line tool, select this one, move tab key and move cursor x direction, make sure see here in red color x direction, so create a line then connect with this, exit, fill it, 5 millimeter, supply all this. okay cancel smart dimension now see distance from this tangent point to this line 15 look this is fully defined this point to this 15 
see here distance from here to here 15 now here to here 8 here to here 8 we will see the radius 5 you will see here 10 36 okay now let's check distance from here to this line by default 8 okay similarly if you see this line to this point 8 don't make this uh, spline with this line tangent relation you don't need to create this is fully defined fine exit now simply go to swift boss base apply swift boss base circular profile and diameter 7 unmerge result because both are different bodies now let me hide this even you can hide let me see here fillet constant type radius 1.5 and select the face both end have same okay now we here we have bought two bodies body two let me apply some color uh, just to identify something different okay the fillet one high gloss plastic cream okay see this is how we model a energy saving lamp i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects inside works thanks for watching